OpenAI has unveiled its new humanoid robot, Neo. Developed by OneX Robotics, Neo represents a significant advancement in the AI industry. It's not just a program running on a computer, it's the fusion of artificial intelligence into a physical body that can interact with the real world. This highly intelligent Android assistant is said to be safe, balanced, and smart. You know what? Let's delve into all we know about this fascinating robot. Talking about the groundbreaking features of Neo, let's begin with its unique physical form. It has a head, torso, arms, and legs, just like us. This enables it to engage with the world in a manner that resonates with our own experiences. It can even communicate through facial expressions. Unlike other funny-looking robots you might have seen before, Neo does not have those sharp or jagged edges that could in case of an accident harm anyone nearby. Neo's exceptionally balanced physique allows it to move in a more natural way, just like humans. It can walk through doors, climb the stairs, and do everything in a more natural way. This robot, with its artificial intelligence and human-like limbs, possesses a unique blend of gentle strength. It is intriguing to see how powerful and natural this robot is. So far, we have only witnessed a few robots that excel in this aspect. We have seen agility robotics robots being demonstrated in a real-world scenario, specifically when packing boxes. Additionally, we have observed a Tesla bots robot walking around and within the Tesla factory premises. Of course, the highly advanced Boston Dynamics robot as well, which boasts unparalleled movement capabilities. This robot has showcased an astonishing array of actions that we never deemed possible, including backflips, dancing, running, and even handing a bag of tools to a construction worker. It will certainly be fascinating to see OpenAI's Neo robot outpace its predecessors. Another notable feature of the robot is its smart behavior. Neo is a unique combination of a well-designed body and an advanced AI mind. This enables you to have natural conversations with it while it effortlessly carries out your requests. Intriguingly, this also means it can also effectively auto-train itself and function seamlessly in a scenario outside its preliminary training. All this is possible because, as you know, the best large language model in the world at present is GPT-4. It is highly likely that a fine-tuned version of GPT-4 will be used in this role, considering the substantial investment from OpenAI. In that case, what exactly can Neo do? According to the innovators, Neo is highly proficient in handling various industrial tasks across sectors such as security, logistics, manufacturing, operating machinery, and managing complex operations. In fact, Neo is expected to extend to providing valuable assistance within households, which includes performing household chores such as cleaning. Additionally, Neo can support individuals with mobility challenges by assisting them in tasks such as fetching items and providing companionship. The potential of Neo extends even further into the realm of research, as it can contribute to the exploration of fields like psychology and artificial intelligence within the robotics community. With Neo's continuous evolution, the possibilities for enhancing productivity, learning, and receiving assistance are truly limitless. So how do you get Neo to execute all these tasks? You can physically converse with the AI, plus, Neo can be controlled through VR teleoperation synchronization mode. In case you are unfamiliar with the term, it refers to the use of virtual reality technology to remotely control and operate robots or other devices situated in a different physical location. With this, you can control and manipulate objects and accomplish tasks as if they were physically present at your specific location. For those who may find this explanation confusing, it's akin to the concept depicted in the movie Pacific Rim, where a person can control a robot by simply moving their hands and achieving synchronization. For instance, in a case where you have gone out and left your robot at home, and you need to check something back at home, it could be the location of an item or simply exploring your home through the robot's perspective. In this case, the VR teleop sync mode can offer an intriguing possibility to accomplish this. However, this begs the question, is the VR teleop sync the primary way to communicate with the robot in its absence? Users ought to be presented with various options. We are yet to have an answer to this, but if you have an idea, feel free to share in the comment section. It was also mentioned that Neo learns from tasks completed through VR teleoperation. So in a case when you are in virtual mode instructing the robot to execute a task, the robot mirrors those exact tasks with its mind and could autonomously execute similar tasks the next time. 
Thanks to this feature, Neo can continuously learn and improve becoming smarter and more capable over time, unlike traditional robots that are programmed to perform specific tasks. Talking about autonomous behavior, Neo has the ability to operate and make decisions independently without direct human intervention or control. It has been equipped with decision-making capabilities that allow it to process information from its environment, assess the current situation, and make decisions based on predefined rules. In situations where AI has the capability to learn from its surroundings or previous encounters and make decisions independently, the safety of its owners becomes a concern. What if the AI becomes hostile and decides to seek revenge on its users? We've all seen movies depicting autonomous AI agents going rogue. Before we conclude today's video, let's delve deeper into Neo's mobility and power. At least, we've got to know if the robot can serve as an effective rescue agent in case of unexpected danger. Neo is powered by an electrical system and weighs approximately 30 kilograms, 66 pounds, making it lighter than most other similar models. It can walk at a speed of about 2.5 miles per hour and run at 7.5 miles per hour. Remarkably, despite its weight, it can carry up to 44 pounds or 20 kilograms, which is quite impressive. So if you weigh less than 20 kilograms, be sure that Neo could help you up when you fall, and if you are more, you can consider hitting the gym to stay fit. As regards the release date, OpenAI recently announced that pre-orders for the Neo robot will be available by the end of 2023. This means that we can expect to witness the debut of this highly advanced AI-powered physical Android, designed and supported by OpenAI's innovative software systems, sometime this year. The company's plan is to initially introduce these robots in North America, ensuring safety and thorough testing before extending the product's reach globally. However, the public release of the robot could replace human workers in construction, manufacturing, and other industries. It could potentially solve the labor shortage crisis as well. While OpenAI remains focused on humanoid robots, there is an ongoing debate within the research community about whether human embodiment is a prerequisite for achieving artificial general intelligence AGI. Intrigued by this development, Chris Anderson, the CTO at Kitty Hawk, tweeted about an intriguing question. Could an AI attain full AGI by becoming embodied and gaining senses and the ability to act in the physical world? This is a question that had left many experts puzzled. And what do you think of this? Even though it is currently unclear whether having a physical body is necessary to achieve AGI, some researchers argue that embodied intelligence, which involves interacting with the environment and perceiving sensory information, is essential for developing AGI. On the other hand, another group believes that it might be possible to achieve AGI without a physical form. However, neither of these contrasting views has been sufficiently supported by research. I hope you enjoyed this journey into NEO. If you found it as fascinating as we did, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel for more captivating content, and share your thoughts and comments below. We would love to hear your feedback and suggestions. Until next time, keep exploring with AI Disclosure, where learning never stops and wonder knows no bounds.